Welcome back, boys. Review time with Goodbye. the It's cough, it's cough, it's 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 cough, it's So true. So anyway, the doctor said I stopped getting nosebleeds if I just kept my fingers out of there. <laughs> oh, dude, you're so funny. Uh, so what should we get? Oh, and how can I help you gentlemen today? Oh, oh, hey. Uh, do you recommend anything? Uh, might I recommend the Coca-Cola with coffee? Mm. Coke with fucking coffee? That doesn't sound very appetizing to me, but uh, sure, I'll try it. What is up, guys? Today, we're checking out all three flavors of Coca-Cola with coffee. We got dark roast, vanilla, and caramel. Or caramel, as some people say. <gasps> but yes, these are hefty little boys. They kind of rival the second level of like Red Bull cans, you know, the little ones and then the big ones. It's, it's, it's these, but they don't boast as much caffeine, which is honestly disappointing. All three of the variants only have 69 milligrams for the whole can, so. Despite being soda and coffee, they both kind of uh, are underwhelming, which kind of sucks. I mean, probably the only reason why uh, I'd want to drink these, because I like coffee. I do not drink Coke or Pepsi anymore outside of reviewing purposes. As a kid, I liked them, and elder, I'm um, not a fan. I don't like uh, colas anymore. but. Whatever, I like coffee. I like coffee flavored things. Uh, a long time ago, Coke tried this before uh, under the name Coke Black. Some people out there might remember it didn't do well. I remember it being pretty good though. My buddy Daniel absolutely raves about these. Uh, and now he's pretty happy because they have these. So shout out to you, Dan. Whew. Okay, first up, I'm gonna try the normal dark blend. And then we're going to go vanilla and caramel. Mm. Let's see what it even looks like. Oof, off the bat, it's a very strong smell. It's weird, it's literally Coca-Cola and somebody spilled a splash of coffee in it. It can't really see too good, but uh, it looks like standard Coke color. Hmm, weird. It uh, starts off with a Coca-Cola taste, but um, the aftertaste is very reminiscent of a nice iced coffee. Uh, it's pleasant, surprisingly, because uh, like I said, I, I don't like drinking Coke anymore as an adult, and this is actually very manageable. The Coke is not strong though. It, Like I said, it, it tastes like I'm drinking a Coke with a splash of coffee, but it's not bad. It, I, I don't think I can really get into it though. Like it's not enough coffee for me personally, but it's not bad. Uh, I have to say the regular Coke for me is three out of five, uh, vastly better than a normal Coke, but not enough clicks and whistles for me just yet. <clears throat> and then next up, we're gonna do vanilla. See how that looks. I don't know why I'm thinking that they're gonna be colored. There looks exactly like the last. Mm. Smells literally like a Coke. I don't even smell the coffee in this one. Mm. Uh, tastes like a vanilla Coke. Or uh, yeah, that's. No, no, no coffee aftertaste. I like vanilla, I like vanilla flavoring. This is actually good. Uh, the Coke is very mild. Like normally Coke is very sharp. <clears throat> I like the mildness of it because of the vanilla, but there's literally 
there's nothing to this at all. Like for tasting, it tastes good, but it's honestly a letdown. It's really hoping for a more uh, coffee taste. Uh, I'll be able to finish it because it's the mellowness of it, like I said, but uh, I'm honestly kind of disappointed. It's two and a half out of five uh, for, I don't know, the whole of it. It's, but it tastes better. It's more on par with the three, I would say. But if you're expecting like a really good vanilla coffee kind of taste, you're you're gonna be very disappointed. There's nothing there. Uh, okay. Last but not least, the caramel. I'm very excited about this. I like caramel ones and I like caramel coffee. So I am hoping for something a bit more than the last two. Again, looks just like a Coke. Has a slightly more of a yellowish green. Eh. Nah. <clears throat> Pouring it out, it looks a little more lighter than enough, but in the cup, it looks still like a Coke. Mm, very Coke. Light caramel smell. Mm, nothing, nothing crazy. Mm. Okay. I'm actually gonna go in for a little more of this one. The caramel is very strong in this one, and I like it. This is definitely the best one of the three. It tastes very good. It's way stronger than the last two. Uh, <clears throat> the caramel makes the coke taste great like that's really good the aftertaste is even better it's just tastes like i'm eating like caramel candy very good it's sweet but not too sweet uh, four to five i think uh caramel is the strongest one if you find any of these i recommend that one uh, the other two are okay the uh, the dark blend to me just isn't strong enough it's not bad it's just not strong enough Vanilla is very underwhelming. I wish it was more prominent. Stronger flavor too. All three collectively are not bad drinks though. But caramel is probably the only one I'll go and buy again. So that's it for me, friends. Subscribe, but don't forget to vibe. Don't forget to vibe.